boxes. Do you need one? The, the short answer is no. It used to be an integral part of the support system where you'd have coils in the mattress, coils in the box, and that mattress was so basic that you needed something below that had some give to make it so it didn't feel like you're sleeping on the floor. As beds got thicker and softer, it became much less impactful having a bed that had a box below that had additional give. However, when you're buying a new mattress, if you have an old box spring, you probably want to replace it. Most boxes nowadays are just fabric covered slat systems. They have no give. And that fabric covered slat is gonna be supporting it the same way you'd get out of a quality platform bed. With that said, not all platform boxes are great. You don't want one with cardboard in the top of that box because the glue point between the wood and the cardboard usually fails and you end up with squeaking over time. So you want one that's got enough slats going all the way from head to foot. Somewhere between 12 and 15 is great. If you have fewer than that, you're oftentimes going to have some sagging between the slats or they'll have put the cardboard there to hide the fact that they've used so few slats. If you have a platform bed, great. Not all platform beds are going to support a mattress properly. So look at our link for is my platform bed sturdy enough to know if you've got to do some extra reinforcement to make sure that your mattress is supported as well as you are.